yeah, we're just wrapping up a killer, uh, killer few days here at the Vela Solutions headquarters in Flint. I absolutely had an incredible time. Everyone was so friendly. We got to ride some really cool and unique stuff. And we're ending it off with the boys at the lake. So, boat, rock, you'll come. A couple backflips off the rock, slow mo, cool badass shots, freeze my balls off, and then we out. <laughs> oh, it's a burning deluxe dude after yesterday. <laughs> You know, Claudio's got the endurance. So to all the viewers out there, if you're sick, you have to go into the cold water or take cold showers because the hot water will just multiply your bacteria. Scientist Eddie. That was nice. Hope you guys enjoyed the show. <laughs> We're coming back for you. Hanging out with Claudio at his home for the past four days has been unreal. Thanks for showing us around. Cheers, man. <laughs> Alright guys, we have made our way back to Zurich. A lot of the riders are showing up today, so we're super excited to get back with everyone. And yeah, we just caught the train right into the center station and we're gonna go check out the town. My first time to be in Switzerland, and I really like the country. The city is too big. The country is so beautiful. I've only been here for the morning and, and I'm just, amazed by it, so yeah, <laughs> I'm pretty fun. Some good cars, some good girls, and nice views right here. <laughs> uh, we don't get to see that much of the countries most of the time, we're just going there to race, you know, so, um, so yeah, just go there, rest, and get ready for the race, that's all I do. So uh, going to the mountain uh, two days ago and it was just awesome, you know. I haven't seen that much of Switzerland, that's why it's really special for me as well. It's like I'm discovering, even if it's not far from France, I'm still discovering a lot of stuff here. That's the cool thing about bikes, it takes you so many cool places. Like I know people from, or I've heard of a lot of people from a bunch of different countries, so that's definitely a cool part of it. Yeah, we went to this really cool, um, we're in Old Town, and it's a really cool winery, and they had this really cool challenge, and um, you know, we're all really competitive, so we had to give it a go. The challenge they're making for about uh, 80 years now. Uh, you, have to, you have to climb up over this beam, then you go over the second one, but the second while you're hanging down, I bring you a glass of white wine, you have to drink it upside down, and when you get this, then you can write your name in here. Can you show us how to do it? No, you can show us how to do it. make it, it's, uh, well, I don't know, it's like uh, just uh, 10 seconds of uh, fighting non-stop just so you can get your elbows and then uh, once, you're, once you're in it's okay. But I, first when I put my, my arms there I was like it's impossible. Go for it now. I almost gave up and then I was like, I can't because Eddie did it, so I have to do it. <laughs> 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 
I don't even know how much names there is here. I don't. I don't know how it happens. That much people like succeeding at I this. I feel like any bigger than us, it's almost impossible because how tight it is. <laughs> So, hey, the question is, the question is, can you do it the way we did it? No, yes, like, no. You can't because can. you need power, too right? Big. You're too big. Yeah. So this is technique, this is full, full technique, technique yeah. and uh, what we did is like full power. That's it. Hard work, Fuck yeah. conquered the the challenge we got to drink some wine upside down and it was super fun about four or five of us conquered it so I'm glad I was one of them and the first girl so so yeah stoked that uh, I was able to do that and uh, I got to put my name on the wall so icing on the cake for the day yeah.